Hello guys, welcome back. In this video, let's talk about Grog. Grog recently introduced this Lava version 1.57b on the cl Grog cloud. So in this video, what we will be doing is I'll first walk you through this blog post and then I will show you how you can use this particular model in the Grog cloud itself and how you can integrate the Grog API into the OpenWave UI so that you can use all the models from the Grog cloud in the OpenWave UI itself. Let's get started. Okay, this is the blog post. As you can see here, this is introducing the Lava version 1.57b on the Grok cloud. So what is Lava first? You need to understand that, right? So Lava is the large language and vision assistant. So we can provide images and it provides the uh, what is in the image and so on, right? You can just go through this blog post here. And by the way, it is based on the OpenAI's clip and a fine-tuned version of Meta's Lama 27 billion. So you can just go through this. What can we do? Okay, visual question answer, you know, caption generations, OC and multimodal dialogues and so on right so there are unlocking the new use cases what kind of use cases that you can do from it and then also the in the industry is specific in the education retail finance factory line industry specific benefits so you can just go through here get some idea of how you can integrate this into your uh, existing application right so now let's go through the grog console itself i will provide the link in the description first you need to of course create the account here and if you go to the playground by the way if you are completely new to the grog i have already created some videos about grog before if you just want to know on the high level what is grog grog is the fast ai inference provider just to show you how it works if i say hi here you can see how fast the answer is already being provided you can just hover on top of it and you will see all the input tokens and output tokens and so on right so now let's go to the grog playground and from here as you can see here this is the lava version 1.5 right so what we can do here is it says okay drop image here or use the local file right you can just take some of the images i can just go here and maybe i can take open this is just the image i am providing here and i can just ask here okay can you provide some information about this image and submit it will go through this particular image and then it will provide the answer for us okay this image features a computer screen with a chat app icon likely a messaging app the app is displayed in a large bold font making the main focus of the image the screen is filled with various icons and buttons okay some of the things is mentioning here this is just the demo example but for you you can use the main use cases and see how it uh, works for you right so this is how you can integrate this in the google uh, grog cloud uh, i'm saying google all the time grog uh, cloud um, itself so you can use the benefit and if you just hover on top of this you can see what is this uh, information the speed insights and all the different things that is being provided here so that is how you can use in the uh, playground itself but the main thing is how to integrate this into the open wave uh, ui right uh, last video was about this open wave ui i'll show you here so yeah this is the open wave ui if i go to the videos it's like one hour and six minutes this is the first time i'm creating this kind of long videos but many of you are finding it helpful i recommend you to watch that particular video if you want to know more information about the open web ui but i will start from where i left because when i ended the video i said that you can on and off the app with this docker itself now i have already run it here but what i could have done is just stop this and then on that's all how you can stop and on this for this video i'm not going to use the olama models but i will be just using the grog one to show you now it is starting i can just go here you can see it is opened here and you can have all the history conversations already here you can just go here and choose the models right now there is no models because i have not started the olama server and this one is just the model that I created so it is shown here but it also does not work here because it is integrated behind the scene with the Olama and if I say hi it will not work because there is no model associated with it but then I am going to integrate with the Grog cloud how to do that just go to this icon your name may be there and if you go to this admin panel go to the settings go to the connections and here I have already connected before to test with the grog cloud 
so this is the endpoint that you need to provide and the api key here right so from where i get this uh, endpoint right that is the good question if i go here if i go to the playground itself there is this documentation just go to any of the example here maybe with the quick start also and by the way there is also the information about the vision mentioned here you can just go here and see what is the capability of it what is the limitations right there are some limitations also and how to use the vision and so on but for me i will go here and see in the call there is this in point if you see here we can just take this in point until this slash v1 so you can just copy this one and go to this open wave ui and then just paste it here that's it about the api key now you can go to the website itself let me make this bigger go to the api keys and create a new api key i will say here open wave ui summit and it is being created i will just go back here and then here i will just paste it Control v and i will save it successfully right now i can go to the new chat before there was no model being shown except the translate which i created myself but now you can see all the different models are being populating here from where did this model appear they are all from this grog cloud so but for example if you don't want to use lava you can just want to use the llama model just click the llama model and they just say hi and you can see how fast it responds you can say can you write me a song in llm it will go here and say okay i'm happy to generate a song for you this 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 mood and all the different things so you can the idea here is not the prompt and answer but how fast it provides the response also right for us we are now uh, going to go through the lava so if i go down here there is this lava version 1.5 the same one that we used before and here you can just upload or you can just copy some images for example now let's use different example here if i go here okay, i'll say dawn mm, i will open this and maybe if i go to the about uh, or i will go here about grog i will just take this example copy image and i will go to the chat open wave ui i will just paste it here Control v i will say here okay can you explain me about this image right so you can see this is the image every old matters and something like this it art piece a series series of letters and numbers are written together in a, a scrambled a form resembling many fingers you can see it just goes through this image and it provides the answer for us so now you can use this for any uh, images so that is how the uh, lava model works so yeah that's all i want to show you in this video quick uh, demo how you can use the newly integrated lava uh, model in the uh, you can try it from the console itself as well as from the uh, open wave ui and by the way if you want to use this with the other llama index or um, lang chain or some other providers you can see there is this integrations also being shown here you can just go there and then try uh, which one you want to use in your applications okay that's all i want to show you in this video thank you for watching and see you in the next one